What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to a brand new episode of the Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Wonderlock here on the channel. We are about to go to Marvel City. Today we have a bunch of encounters that we can get and of course we have a gym battle that we can get uh, as well which is going to be the important part. But let's head into the city because I think we have to do a little bit of cutscenes. We, we battle Wally at one point, don't we? Yeah, here's Wally. Yeah, what's up Wally? What you got for me, baby? Wally's talking to what is his, his dad. Also, we get our bike this time too. I, I, that's definitely gonna be the play. Oh, okay, so Wally's gonna go to to the gym. That's something uh, for us to you know do for sure. But let's go to the the, the, the bike place. Can, can we get a bike? Let's, let's grab a bike. I think that's gonna be for uh, important first. And then uh, actually, I I don't really know. Do I have any Pokeballs on me? Uh, Pokeballs. I have ten Pokeballs and some Great Balls. Okay, cool. So we should be set for our encounters as well. We're probably going to have a bunch of uh, battles that we can do as well to grind up our levels. But, I mean, I think I want to get the encounters first. I think the encounters is going to be the important part because I can get options, if that makes any sense. Hey, what's up, bro? Are you going to give me a bike? Yeah, I came from far away, bro. Yeah, man. Let's give me a bike. Give me a bike. Uh, damn, I don't know which bike I want. Uh, the mock bike is the one that goes fast. The acrobite is the one that you can do, like, tricks with. Uh, which was the most important one? I mean, I know I can always come back and switch it up. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna grab the acro bike. Just, I guess just cuz. We'll grab the acro bike and just go from there. Alright, cool. We have our bike. Oh, we can also go back down and uh, take on all the people on the bi the cycling path. And challenge all the people on there uh, to get more XP as well. Uh, how are our Pokemon looking right now? Do, or is everybody kind of healed up? Everybody for the most part is kind of healed up. Uh, we're about to reach that level 30 gap though. Um, the rest of the squad's doing okay. Let's get some encounters in, actually. We're, we're gonna try to get some encounters in. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get into some battles. Uh, we have one to the right, one up north, and one to the left of this city. So, at least three encounters. Took me forever, but we finally got an encounter. Let me guess. Oh, dude, I legitimately thought it was gonna be another tentacle. I was gonna lose my mind. But no, I think, I think we're done with the whole tentacle debacle. Uh, we get another encounter. Uh, this is our Route 218. Uh, we can't really hit this thing, I'm going to be honest with you guys. Uh, plus, I don't have anything I can learn False Swipe. I think we checked that last episode. So we're going to try to catch this Magikarp, which, to be honest, should be relatively easy. We're going to rename it, get uh, the uh, the nickname going, you know, the same thing, right? And then uh, we're going to Wonder Trade, and we're going to try to get something good, because I'm looking to replace Linoon. Oh, this guy's training a Volcanium for Celebi, so that, or at least that's what he was originally named, or I don't know. No, his name's Mark. That was his message. That's what he was trying to get, Volcanian. Trying to sell out a Poochiana. Surprisingly, this is my first Poochiana on, on uh, the series, which is baffling, to say the least. But we now have a Poochiana on the squad. Well, we're not going to put it on the squad, but we have it available to us, which is cool. I mean, I, let's be honest. Let's be honest. There's no way that I'm really replacing a Lainu with a Mighty Yen. Like, I, I just, they're basically the same Pokemon. There's no need for me to replace them. Alright, so now I'm going to get my Route 117 encounter. I just know that this, this route, I'm, I'm going to be real with you guys. This route 100% feels like my, bet, my my most favorite route because it's the one that has the daycare, which is kind of important, right? But I feel like it has a ton of trainers. So if I'm really trying to get some levels, because I want Dawn Fan to shine in this one. I don't think I'm going to have a Dawn Fan by the time the gym battle occurs. Uh, but... If I can get Vampy to be like the star of the show, that's that's the goal. That's 100% the goal. Alright, so what's my 117 encounter going to be? What are you going to be? This one should be easy because it's a grass encounter. An Oddish. Easy. Say less. I'm going to Great Ball this thing. I should be fine. It shouldn't do too much damage to my Plus to think about it. After this battle though, I do need to heal my Pokemon. Plus has been going through everybody. But yeah, let's catch the Pokemon. You guys know the deal. Catch the Pokemon, rename it, send it on Wonder Trade, and hope we get something good. So to, to be honest with you guys, I'm actually getting a good variety of Pokemon in my box right now. And I honestly thought I would lose somebody by now. This is probably like foreshadowing somebody's loss, right? Somebody's death. But uh, yeah, trading out the one, uh, the Oddish and we're getting a C dot in return. Uh, this is definitely new for us, I think. I'm pretty sure. Uh, which I'm okay with. It is another grass type Pokemon for us to potentially use. Um, C dot, well, it really shift tree. I don't know if I really want to use it though. It's a cool Pokemon, has access to fake out and all that cool stuff, but I'm gonna be real with you. It's not all that appealing for me to actually throw on the team. I, I'm liking the team so far. I just wish I had better options. Okay, so I think this last trainer that I just took on 
is about to give us enough, or gave us enough XP for our Ralts to evolve into a Curlia, which is good. We just got another evolution on, on the side of the team, and starting off this episode is really good. Also, I did look up a little bit earlier what level Fanfi evolves into a Dawn fan, so to see if I could ever be prepared for this next gym leader. And it says that uh, Fanfi evolves at level 25, which Fanfi is at level 21 at the moment. So I don't know if I'll reach it by the time the gym leader comes around. Um, but if anything, I'll probably start prioritizing using them in, in battles and hope for the best, honestly. But we now have a Curlier on the squad, which is good. Um, we're that much closer to getting the Guard of War. And that team, they, like, that I don't think is ever going to leave the squad. I'm telling you, I think it's just the Lion Noon. I think the Lion Noon is going to be the thing that goes. Oh, also, we're in Verdant Turf uh, Town. This is uh, actually the town that Wally's from, if I'm not mistaken. So we're going to heal up. There's something to do in the cave, and we're going to show that in just a second. It's the same cave where we actually saved Biko a couple episodes ago. Uh, so it's something else for us to continue doing in this series. Okay, so if I'm not mistaken, there's a couple that can't see each other. Yep. If we only had a Pokemon that could use Rock Smash, if we asked it, it could break up the boulders in no time flat. So uh, I don't think I have Rock Smash available to me. And uh, I don't know what they would actually offer in this. Oh, I don't have any HMs. Oh, my God. But, uh, yeah, you can break this up and you can save them. They're, like, lovers and stuff like that. And they hook you up, give you a nice item. Uh, that At one point, we're going to be doing that. But it looks for the time being, we are a little ahead of ourselves. Uh, is there any patch of water we could potentially uh, fish at? No, there's no patch of water here. So there goes that. Um, one last thing before we go take on the gym leader at this point is we're going to check up the uh, route north of uh Mauville and then go from there all right since we're here let's talk to wally let's see what's going on i'm pretty sure i battle wally in like a little uh trainer battle here and i still think that he only just has a ralt so it's just gonna overall be an easy battle for us um because he's over here trying to challenge a gym leader and he's trying to challenge the third gym leader he hasn't even challenged uh roxanne yet or uh brawly oh, yo what's up wally what up dude what you want me to do you want me to beat you up real quick yeah, he does want to battle. Yeah, I'll beat you up real quick, Wally. Say less, man. Say less. Now, uh, Frog of actually uh, got to level 30, so this is... I mean, I'm, I know I'm going to breeze through this. I just trying to get these Pokemon to actually listen to me is going to be rough, honestly. But uh, I do have it level 30, which is good. Easy. It's still just a Ralt. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I apologize. I apologize. Look, look. Um, trust me. It's not going to listen to me. Watch. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry, Wally. I, I, didn't, I didn't mean to go. I didn't mean for you to go down this way, but okay. So Ralts goes down. We'll continue. Wally's gonna be like, he's gonna be set out on his adventure. He's like, you know what? Oh, Fanfi uh, got to level twenty-two, so we're getting close, close, but we're not there yet. Uh, Wally's gonna set out on his adventure because he wants to challenge us. Well, he he wants to be strong like us. I guess this is the best way of saying it. Yeah, he, he 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 got really discouraged, but then his uncle's like, no, bro, you gotta. What are you doing? What are you doing? Get, get ready for your adventure. Oh, wait. Does the uncle give me a rock smash? That'd be pretty cool. Oh, he's going to call me a rival. Is he going to call me Oni-chan? Ooh. Uh, yo. Ooh season? Yo, are you going to give me an HM? Please tell me you're going to give me something. Uh, What are you going to give me? Yeah, there's rock smash. Okay, cool. I should have done this before going to the cave before. Uh, okay. Will I be able to use this? Uh, wow, he's not going to tell me if I need this gym to do so. But that means we have to take on this gym. We're going to check the route up for up north to see if we have access to it first and foremost. And go from there. But, uh, we do have Rock Smash now. We can go back and do that at one point. And that's going to be the plan for sure. Uh, but let's check for the, uh, encounter. Okay, so I'm on Route 111. I just had to confirm something. Uh, I can't really go any further without Rock Smash. And I'm pretty sure I need the third gym badge for me to use Rock Smash. Uh, so you're like, oh, so you don't get an encounter? Wrong. There's a patch of water right here. We're going to fish up an encounter. We have a bunch of great balls to go through. Whatever we catch, we're trading it out. That's our encounter. That's our Route 111 encounter. Another Magikarp. That's fine. That's fine. I'll be that guy. I'll be trading out Magikarps out into the world. You get a Magikarp. You get a Magikarp. You get a Magikarp. Uh, I just want something good in return. I know I'm not sending things out that are phenomenal, sure, but I want to see if somebody out there is like hooking up a brother, sending out some good stuff. Cause I, I you know, I, I want to be rewarded. Reward me, game. Ooh, from Germany. Okay, let's see if we get something good from Germany. Magikarp, let it bud. Come on, come on, reward me. Give me, yo. My goal is a shiny or a legendary at all. I just want one of those throughout this series. A Wingle. Oh, that 
I mean, I get it. I get it. I really do understand why I, get, I can get a Wingle here. But you know what? As long as it's not Zigzag Goons and Ralts, like I've been told, I guess, I guess I'll take a Wingle. Wingle's okay. Not not cool enough to really replace the Zigzag Goon, though. I'm going to be honest with you. Not really cool to replace the Zigzag Goon. Before we actually head on to challenge the gym leader, I'm going to be real with you. These guys terrified me growing up. Terrified me. Because it was four consecutive battles. You couldn't heal. And if one got you low, you got really, really scared. For, you know, and, and for the purpose of this video, we're going to do this, right? They don't really give me anything that really matters to me in general, to be honest. But I will gladly, gladly take the XP. The only thing is I have Ferrari here and Plus will both at level 30, which is basically their cap. Uh, if they go up to level 31, they are definitely not going to listen to me. But these are two Pokemon that I really don't even want to use for the gym battle anyway. So... I say let's just go in there with Frogadier. Let's see if Frogadier can clear out all four trainers. Uh, easy. Yeah, series of battles. I'm going to battle four of you guys. It's going to be a breeze. They give you a, ma uh, a Macho Brace at the end, which is, I believe it's good for uh, EV training and all that stuff if you're playing competitive. But I'm going to be real with you guys. This game came out in, what, 2015, 2016? If you're playing competitive, I would assume that you guys are playing on Sword and Shield. That's all I'm saying. But we're gonna, we should breeze through these guys. I just really don't want to get to level 31. Please, game, don't do this to me. Um, but I, I do want Fan P, because Fan P is at level 22, to get a little bit closer to to becoming a Dawn fan, because it's going to be an MVP for our... Um, you mean MVP for our uh, squad, to be honest. Well, in this particular battle. I will be honest, in this particular battle. Uh, but yeah, so this first trainer goes down, which is good. Uh, I don't know if you guys have seen it before where it's just like, you know, one's better than the other. And then at one point you actually uh, encounter it. So it's it's uh, father, mother, daughter, and grandma. And at one point throughout, uh, like in Victory Road, like later on in the game, you also come across the uh, the son as well, which is pretty cool. It's like, it's a full, like, dynamic. And it's like, uh, in my in my way of seeing it, it's very uh, complete. Like, it completes the circle. So Rosalia actually seems like this would be a lot more hard, uh, harder for me to take on. I'm still gonna just keep going Water Pulse and see how this plays out. But that Rosalia is level 20, so that's ew. oh definitely. I, I probably want to switch out on. Oh, I got the confusion. That's good. That's good, right? That counts for something. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit. Your... Yes. Oh man, I actually did quite a lot. How about you know what? We're gonna Water Pulse again, and we're gonna hope that it hits itself again. If that's the case, ooh, this game would, yeah, hit yourself. All right, let's see how this plays out. Oh, you're holding a bear, orange berry, citrus berry. What are you holding? Orange berry. That's not too bad. Hit yourself though. Yeah, yeah. No. And it sets up leech seed. We definitely have to see a switch out. So leech seed is probably my least favorite thing when it comes to a Pokemon game. I'm gonna be honest with you. Sleep powder, I'm okay with. Right. Spore, I'm okay with. Leech seed is annoying. Annoying. I. I Mm -mm, you can't tell me otherwise. I'm going to go to uh, Metang here. Metang could probably uh, tank any hits. And plus, I have Confusion, so I should take out the uh, Roselia. Hopefully easier. Hit yourself. Oh, I forgot that. I forgot the Roselia was still confused, to be honest. But no, it doesn't matter. Mega Dream's going to do, like, what? Seven? Yeah, it's not doing a lot. Not doing a lot. L let's see what one Confusion from Metang can do, though. Because Metang does take a sweet time to level up, but... Let's see, let's see. One Confusion takes right out don't even have to stress it don't even have to stress it so trainer number two goes down so we have two more trainers to go through Linoon's at level 25 dude maybe i might just lead Linoon. like Linoon is gonna be my, my like th the thing that carries me in this gym um if i had a ground type pokemon i would go fampy out there just no matter what the only thing is it doesn't really have anything that's ground type uh and then i will 100 percent feel like i would run into uh magnemites and Boltorbs, both of which have sonic boom so it's going to be doing that constant 20 damage, and I, I'm not feeling it. A Goldeen. Okay. Uh, here. Yo, you, how much do you think a Quick Attack would do on a Goldeen? I, I'm, I'm intrigued. How much would a Quick Attack do on a Goldeen? Two shots it. Two shots it. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, let's go. I was like, I don't want to get Supersonic. It's the same as Confuse Ray. It's not as bad as Leech Seed, I don't think. Maybe. I, I Maybe I'm talking a little too early. I'm not, I'm not too, like... Bond of the, oh, we definitely have to switch now. Okay, so Shroomish, we can go to Plusle. And Plusle has Swift. We'll, we'll, we should be fine. Um, but yeah, uh, Leech Seed is mad annoying. I won't lie. Leech Seed is really annoying. 
I, th I think the way it goes is like Leech Seed, then it goes like Confuse Ray, um, and and uh, Supersonic stuff like that. Maybe Sleep Powder and Spore underneath that, but like I'm not really stressing that. Like, not that big of a deal. But yeah. <laughs> so uh, I didn't I didn't even pay attention, but yeah, Shroomish goes down. How many more Pokemon do you... I think, I think she has one more Pokemon. Right? Because this is... Oh, plus was at level 31. So this thing's definitely not going to listen to me. Oh, it wants to learn Discharge, though. Say less, though. Uh, Yo, what's better? Electro Ball? Or Discharge? Discharge does that 80. Electro Ball... The faster the user uh, is in the target, the greater the move. Uh, we'll get rid of... Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll get rid of... Uh, Electro Ball, and then we'll go Discharge. I don't know how fast Blussel is. I'm going to be honest with you. I would assume it's quick. No more. Okay, we definitely want to switch out on this one. We'll go back into Frogadier. Uh, but I think Blussel, at, at this point, will no longer listen to us. So that's something to know, right? Because I only have two gym badges. The first one was level 20. second one's level 30. It would make sense that Blussel doesn't listen to me anymore. And then after this particular battle, I don't think Frogadier is going to listen to me either. Which is going to suck. Um, I, I thought I, I thought I would never come across this this situation that I'm in again. Like I, I'd be fine. First gym leader is gonna be like that. That's just how it is, right? I, I, I didn't think I would have to come back into it. Fampy's at level 23. Two levels, guys. Two levels. Do we have? Oh, do we have a rare candy? If I had a rare candy, I ooh, I would love to use a rare candy. Okay, so we have one more battle for these guys, and it's the grandma. The grandma should be easy. I think the grandma has a meta type, doesn't she? I think. One Pokemon, it's a Meditite, right? Yeah, I remember this clearly. Well, I, w I wouldn't say clearly, but I do remember this for sure. Uh, so, it does have access to Fake Out. Like, that's going to be the big thing. Uh, level 22. I think I'm actually going to switch over to Metank here. Yeah, I, I don't see why not. Let's switch over to Metang. And then I have access to Confusion, which I think should be good. Do I, do I resist Fighting-type moves? Force Palm. Let's see how this does. I mean, they didn't do a lot. I didn't, I, I didn't really do a lot. Meditate that it is setting up on me, though. Uh, that's booting, boosting its attack. Mm, that's a little bit more scary. I won't lie. That was a crit, though. Oh, that is a lot more scary. Or terrifying. Uh, as Frogadier, Frogadier is not a dark type, right? It doesn't become a dark type until um, it becomes a Greninja, right? Do I... Do I... I'm, I'm gonna confuse confusion again. Force palm. Oh, you can cause paralysis off of a uh, force palm. Okay, I am three shotting it. I do. I do want to heal. I definitely do want to heal here. No, do I want to switch? I probably should switch. I probably should switch. It doesn't have pursuit, right? Like I don't, I shouldn't be worried about pursuit trapping. No, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. So yeah, we're we're gonna switch here. Meditate's force palm. It's it's not gonna be like beating up my frog here. It's gonna do a little bit of decent damage because of the meditate and stuff like that. But I should be fine. Let's see if it listens to me though. Nope. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. We're in a, we're in that situation where it doesn't want to listen to me anymore. And now frog deer is paralyzed. See, I knew this. Maybe I didn't want to do this. Maybe I didn't want to do this battle. What about Plusle? What about Curlia? I'll, I'll go into Curlia in this instance. And I, I feel like it's not going to do a lot to me. And then I have Confusion. Then I have Draining Kiss. I don't think it's going to do a lot to Curlia. Because Curlia is a fairy type Pokemon. Yeah, see? That, that's not a lot. Yeah, it's not very effective. That's not a lot. Okay, cool. We're going to do uh, Disarming Voice. Oh, what is that? Oh, that did a lot. I mean, we're fine. That did a lot more than I thought it would, though. This, this family is no joke. I'm telling you, four consecutive battles is, is no joke, honestly. Like, at a gym, I can go out and, and go heal, right? You know what I mean? But, like, in, in here, four consecutive battles, no joke. But we got a bunch of XP. We got a bunch of uh, money, too, which is good. So we're going to be buying some stuff. And then we can get the Macho Brace. I'm going to be real with you. The Macho Brace doesn't matter to me. So, yes. Okay, so the time's come for the, the, the gym battle. Uh, well, not the gym battle per se, but like the trainers and leading up to the gym battle. We actually put Fampy in the lead because electric type Pokemon can't do anything with us, but we do have to worry about things like Sonic Boom, like I mentioned earlier. Um, 
We are still a long way from Donphan. We are two levels, two whole levels away from Donphan. But I did add, of course, uh, a new move to Donphan. Uh, I went ahead and added uh, Rock, not Rock Smash. No, yeah, I added Rock Tomb. I added Rock Tomb to Donphan. Uh, so this sh hopefully helps us out in the long run. Uh, another thing that I probably should have added was probably Rock Smash, considering that did nothing. Did practically nothing. So Rock Smash is probably not a bad idea. Not a bad idea, honestly. Uh, Flail. Flail. Flail has to do a lot more, right? Oh, this is gonna take forever. This is gonna take forever. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, what, what can I do? Let's go to Matang. Uh, let's worry about Matang here. Uh, I think Matang can do a lot better here. I, okay, I didn't think I was gonna have that rough of a situation. Uh, Rock Smash is probably the best bet. I need a Rock Smasher anyway, so uh, why not? Uh, <laughs> why not have um, our Fanfi be our Rock Smasher? Yeah, see, that does a lot more. Well, I wouldn't say a lot more, but it does more. And then I'm, I'm paralyzed. T, -w T Wave sucks. T Wave sucks. And I still have another Pokemon to go through, which I don't even know what it's gonna be, and I'm thinking it's probably gonna be a Voltorb. Like, I, there's. <sighs> why, why, why couldn't you just. Knock out, please. Tackle, that's fine. But I'm pretty sure the other one's Voltorb. And I don't think it has, like, self-destruct or anything like that. I don't think I have anything to really worry about when it comes to the Voltorb. But it's just, it's annoying. Let's see, Voltorb. An Electric. Okay, cool. Uh, this time, you know what? Let me switch this over. Maybe, 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 just maybe. Uh, Because I, I really don't know my typings that well. Maybe Rock. Tomb didn't do that much because it was against the Steel type Pokemon, but Electric's a solo, like a solo um, Electric type Pokemon. Let's see how this plays out. So, Fampy, Rock, Tomb, a lot better. So yeah, I mean, maybe maybe that's that was the reason why. I do want to add Rock Smash though. If I'm if I am gonna have if I if I am gonna struggle against the uh, Magnemites and stuff like that, I do want to throw Rock Smash on there. Rock Smash should help me in the long run. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do that real quick as we go into our next battle. All right. So second gym battle. Let's make it happen. I thought it was Youngster Joey for a second there. Youngster Ben. Electrite. Okay. Cool. We just did this battle, so we know that uh, Fanfi should be able to cover this fairly easy. Um, level seventeen two. Fanfi has levels on it. Let's see what how much Rock Smash does. It's gonna it's gonna what odors what odor sleuth. I was identified. What's it, what's it going to do to me? How much does Rock Smash do? Okay, Rock Smash isn't doing that much. How about if I go Rock Tomb? How much is Rock Tomb going to do? Let's see, let's see. Rock Tomb does definitely a lot more. Definitely a lot more. Uh, I'm going to go the Rock Tomb route. That's fine. And then Fanfi gets some more uh, XP out of this. Hopefully, like... Oh, it might happen. It actually might happen. The more that I think about it, it might... Uh, I hope it happens right before uh, taking on the gym leader. If it happens right before taking on the gym leader, I'd, I'd be really happy. All right? I think we take on three trainers here. Oh, man. I might not. I, I think it's only three floors, the third floor being the, the gym leader. Yo, should I be scared of a Meditite now that I think about it? I, I Why is this not an electric type Pokemon? What's going on? Should I switch out just in case? What's one rock tomb? What's one rock tomb? Confusion? Let's see how much that's supposed to be. Uh, not too much, but I'm confused. I was like, eh, not too much, but I'm confused. Don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself. I'm mad. I'm, I'm legitimately mad. Okay, let's heal up real quick. Let's, let's, let's start from the beginning. So we know it has confusion. It's a level 19. It's not as bad as the one that we previously faced. Okay. Confusion again. We know it does what? 10 damage? Like, oh, that was a crit, though. I, I, I don't know if that mattered. I don't know if that mattered. Okay, let's see. A rock tomb. 65. We go down to... Yeah, it does 10. Like I said. It, we does, it does 10. <laughs> Yo, I... Th okay, th this game 100%. 100% this game is just like... Nah, bro. You want an easy episode? We're gonna make this as hard as possible for you. No, I, I, come on. Confusion does its 10. We don't have to stress it out. 
Now it's doing 12. What's up with this high roll game? As I, as like this game is really inconsistent and it's just like, doesn't know. Oh, thank God. Okay. And then let's just hope that it does something. Fappy, I, I need you. I need you to evolve like ASAP. ASAP. You are doing nothing, my guy. Nothing. I need you to evolve ASAP. Curlia, take care of this. Take care of this, please. Confusion does nothing. Yeah. Oh my god, that was that's disgusting. May maybe I want to replace Don Fan now or Fampy, right? It's still not a Don Fan. Maybe I want to replace Thunder Punch. Oh, that's sick. I did a lot. Why did I do a lot? Oh, uh, what? I was like, does that Meditai have like huge power or something? I was crazy. Why did he do so much? Hey, Fampy's level 24. Are you going to learn a ground type move? Slam? I mean, over tackle, sure. But I would have loved a ground type move there. Like, you would have made things easier for me. Okay, so last trainer on this route. I see route. Oh, it's a Boltorb. So th this time around, we know that this thing's going to be annoying because it has Sonic Boom. And I wouldn't put it past it if that's all it did. I, I highly doubt it has self-destruct. I think we're, we're too early in the game for it to have self-destruct. Has rollout, though. That might be terrifying. And honestly, that... Uh, how much is Rock Tomb going to do? Oh, okay. Oh, that was a crit, though. I don't know if that mattered. But... Ho hopefully this is enough to take it down. Rollout overall can be kind of annoying. Shout out to Whitney, right? Please tell me you guys get that. Okay, so down down Voltorb goes. Man, Voltorb is not as bad as I thought it would be. Where's the Sonic Booms at? Where are the Sonic Booms at? That, yo, I, 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 another rollout. Wow, okay. I boosted, I, I said it. I was like, yo, Voltorb is going to do Sonic Boom, Sonic Boom, Sonic Boom, bro. It's like we are playing Street Fighter 2, bro. But no, another crit. Yo, I'm getting crits. I, I, I know, I, I know my uh, fan P has a pickup as an ability, man. But am I? Do I have sub super luck, or why am I hitting all these crits? But okay, Voltorbs go down. Ooh, it actually got good XP there. Line noon, stop getting all my XP. That's all I'm saying. And then let's head up to the next side. No, it's it's sadly, sadly, I I I really wanted to get. I mean, I can. I, no, I. I mean, what? How more iconic would it be if Fanpy evolved into a Dawn fan because of the battle with the gym leader? That sounds so much better, right? Like looking at the storyline, I'm definitely gonna go that route. But I want to heal first. Okay, my dear Watson, what you got for me, baby? Now, if Dawn, oh, I, I keep calling it Dawn fan because I expect it to come out of this battle as a Dawn fan. Uh, if, if I do defeat Watson. Like, I feel like I should. I should be set. But I do know that he does have a Manetric. Um, I've seen good Manetrics in the past carry things like Flamethrower, right? I mean, it's probably not really good overall against uh, Fampy. But I have a feeling he has answers to it. He has to have answers to my Dark Type, or my Dark Type Pokemon. To my Ground Type Pokemon. Uh, Watson, how many Pokemon do you have? So he has a Magnemite. What are the other options that he has? Magnemite, Manetric. And he has a third Pokemon, which is probably going to be a Voltorb. I haven't seen anything else in this gym, except the Meditite, which is awkward being in here. All right, Rock Smash. Prove to me that you're a good addition. Oh, yeah. Two-shotting it. Two-shotting it, baby. And Tackle's not doing anything. Yeah. And, I, I yeah, I, I I think Vampy ends up evolving because of this battle. And, I, I God, I hope, I hope it's so much better. Oh, it's a Magneton. Sonic Boom! Uh, wait, wait. Magna Bomb. What is Magna Bomb? Oh, it's a Steel type move, I would assume. Okay. Well, it, di it didn't really do much for me. Well, that was super effective, but it didn't do much for me either. What if I roll out? No! Why would you have so Super Sonic, bro? Why? Why, why would you have Super Sonic? Okay, my first rollout is a success. It's going to do like one damage. I'm okay with it. 
as long as we successfully continue doing it, I'm, I, let's see how this goes. Magnet Bomb, we know does like seven damage. Yeah, it did, I mean, that kind of did a lot more than I thought it would, honestly. Roll out, two turns, two turns in a row. Good, good, good. Does a little bit more damage. I know it's not very effective, that's fine. Magnet Bomb. At 48, let's see how much it actually does. 12? Does 15. My Orange Berry kicks in, cool. It does do 15, that's something to kind of be worried about. Not, no, 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 don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself, don't hit yourself. Let's go! Oh my god, never mind. Never mind, game. I thought, I, 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 th I thought this game was treating me to a good time here. I didn't hit myself. I went ahead and rolled out. How are you going to miss on the third turn? It was You're just getting there. You're just getting there. All right. Magnet Bomb. Huh? How many, uh, that was a crit. Whew. How many, how many PPs does, uh, PP? How many, like, how many times Magnet Bomb? Like, that's not a move I see every day. So, like, it's, it's weird. I snapped out. That's my first rollout. Cool. We know it, we know it's gonna do only one damage. That's fine. We're getting there. We're setting up. If you miss on the third one again, Don Fan. Oh, I hate Super Supersonic. You know how I said about Leech Seed? Yeah, nah. It's, it's, it's switching it up. Switching it up. And now you hit yourself? Oh my god. Okay. My last super potion. Just because I want to prove a point that this thing could be good. I know it can. Magnet Bomb. I, I, I'm so tempted. Magnet Bomb. I'm so tempted. Let me look it up on my phone. I am so, so tempted. Uh, here, I want to go ahead and just Rock Smash. We, kn we know the constant. Uh, Magnet Bomb. Yes, it's a move. How many PPs do you have? Has 20 PP. 20 PP. So... <laughs> We're going to be here all day, guys. Luckily, I have Soda Pops. Shout out to uh, doing the beach last episode in the Slateport City. We'll be back up to 85 damage. And we're going to... We're going to... Yo, Potion Spam, that's fine. We're not losing a Pokemon. Especially to a Magneton that I know I can beat. Especially to a... Why am I slower now? Wasn't I faster? No, I, I probably was slower. Yo, can you... Can you not... Can you not, honestly? I, dude, I'm so tempted to bring in something like Plusl. So tempted to bring in something like Plusl. Plusl's not gonna listen to me, but it, it, it's like, I'm so tempted. Like, I need I need something there. I need something there. What's he gonna start doing to me once it runs out of uh, Magnet Bonds? I, I'm assuming it has like Thundershock, right? Or, or Discharge or something like that. There's another Magnet Bomb. Please don't be confused anymore. You're still confused, okay? I kind of not. And mm, this, I swear, this thing's hit itself three times in a row. Three times in a row. Okay. Can you stop, please? Okay. I dude, I I wish I was I, I wish I was counting the magnet bombs. I wish I was counting them, to be honest. But he's still going. He's still going. Okay. Snapped out finally. And I'm going to do 10 damage. I'm not going to do much. And he, I'm probably going to trigger the, the super potion right there. No. But you, I am going to trigger the super sonic. I was close. Oh. This guy knows how to get me mad. Oh my god. Uh, you know what? I'm going to risk it. Rock Smash. I'm gonna I'm a risk it. I, I know I'm gonna hit it. I know I'm, I'm glad that wasn't a crit, by the way, because I would have not lived that. And of course you would hit yourself again. Of course. Of course, Fampy. <laughs> if you guys are ever wondering, hey, should I add a Fampy or a Dawn fan to my team? The answer is no. Always no. Never. Finito. Don't. Uh-uh. I wouldn't even bother. I wouldn't even bother. Yo. Yo, if somebody's playing Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, or X and Y for that matter, like right now, like, you know, it's it's Valentine's Day pretty much, right? Like, you, if you are playing, are you, if you're playing this game, please trade me some ground type Pokemon. Please, I desperately need it. Like, I am going crazy. Going crazy. And there, there's the, the Super Potion. I triggered the Super Potion. 
And it goes all the way from the beginning. I snapped out. Cool. Can I get another defense drop, please? Another one? Oh, I got another defense drop? Oh, well, maybe this game wants to give me something good now. Oh, I know a Super Sonic? What? And that was a crit. That was kind of scary, but... Wow. No. How? How? How are you not dead? How? We gotta use another super Soda Pop, dude. We definitely... After this battle, we definitely need to buy a lot of heals. A, a lot of heals. Ha! <laughs> Come on, Magneton. You still have Magnet Bombs. Uh, that's good to know, I guess. That's that's good to know. Maybe it ran... Oh, I was about to say, maybe it ran out of Supersonic. You could miss Supersonic? Dude, why didn't I... Dude, that hit me like six consecutive Supersonics. But I, finally, the Magneton goes down. I get enough XP. I'm going to have a Dawn fan by the end of this battle. Let's just hope that it stays on the team because... It's... Does he not have a Manetric? I swear he has a Manetric on the team. Magnetons is ace? That's so disappointing. That's so disappointing, honestly. What? Uh, he did set up uh, a rollout, though. It's kind of... It's kind of terrifying. Well, the second one only did two damage, okay. I was like, that's kind of terrifying. I dropped that speed, so that means I'm going first. I'm going first. No, I'm still not going first. Okay, so how much are you going to do? Five damage. Okay. <laughs> There's no way he, if he would get five consecutive ro uh, rollouts that he would KO me. Hey, but we finally beat him. No, okay. No wonder that Magneton was a little harder than usual, I guess. It was his ace Pokemon. So I didn't... I, you know what? You know... We'll, we'll take it. We'll take it. Watson, thank you. I'm, I'm actually rather disappointed that it wasn't a Manetric, though. But, Vampy's evolving, which is good. Hopefully. Hopefully, when it evolves, like, on evolution, it learns some sort of ground-type move. It's probably not going to learn Earthquake, but can you learn something else? I don't think High Horsepower is a thing in this generation. Um, dig Magnitude, please? Something like that? Donovan looks cool. Donovan's a cool Pokemon, I'm, I'm not going to lie. But please learn a ground-type move. Please learn a ground-type move. Or not? Oh, it's not Fury Attack. Really? You want to learn Fury Attack? Garbage. Garbage. Yeah, I did not learn it. Garbage. Alright, Watson. Give me my badge. Give me my TM. Give me access to level 40 Pokemon. I think, right? That's what he does. He gives you access to level 40 Pokemon. There's a Dynamo Batch. Rock Smash. Okay. Level 40. Hey, we can do it now. Okay, cool. Because, uh, the reason why I say it is because Greninja is going to be very, or Frogadier is going to be very important for our next gym battle. Um, which, uh, to be honest, next episode probably won't be a gym battle because I do have a lot of things to, uh, to do. Like, a, a, a lot of, uh, Pokemon to catch, storylines, things like that. So, hey, we take the W, though. We have our third gym badge. We're not just done with today's episode, though. Guys, I'm going to be real with you. Before we get on to the last thing that I actually want to do this episode... I just found out, and this Pokemart, the second shopkeeper, has TMs. One of which is Bulldoze. And, and, and I'm going to be honest with you, I'm a little mad. I'm a little mad. I wish I knew this. I wish I would have gotten this before. Fampy should have had it breeze right. Fampy, Don Fan, would have been the star of that gym battle if it wasn't for me not checking this shopkeeper but we're gonna get it now we're gonna teach it to him now because god he needs something my god now i'm broke by the way now i'm broke all right so the final thing that we're gonna be doing in today's episode is actually something to do with true love and the reason why i'm bringing this up guys is because today is valentine's day so if you guys are celebrating valentine's day happy valentine's day hopefully you spend it well with your significant other or wife or whatever the case may be as long as you have a good time spend it well I know a lot of my peeps a lot of my homies out there are single as well so it's single awareness day but shout out to you guys as well hopefully you spend it well uh, honestly I think I will too so what we want to do is we actually want to help the couple in uh, rust turf tunnel break through with rock smash that that's what we want to do yeah that, we're, we're gonna use rock smash we're gonna destroy these rocks they're gonna see each other they're going to fall in love. They're going to stay in love. Yo, what are you going to give me? Agronite. Oh, we got our first Mega Stone. If we get an Agronite, we can add it to the team. Probably be a better option than 
Don fan, honestly. <laughs> I don't want to be the one to say it. But we made it happen. We broke through. So now we have easy access if we want to go back to uh, Rustbro and things like that, which is good. We take it as a W. So if you guys are here and reached it to the very end of this video, if you guys did enjoy, make sure to smash that like button. Subscribe to join the Legion today. Turn on those notifications so you guys never miss a video. This video did go out a day late. Just this entire weekend has been a hassle, guys, but I'm glad that this video came out. Hopefully you guys spend Valentine's Day really well. We do have that goal. Let's get 15 likes on the video. Comment on this video so I know you guys are enjoying it. Let me know how you guys spent your Valentine's Day. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.